Hi, I'm Mike Fuline. I'm the head men's basketball coach, I'm assistant athletic director, and uh, a lecturer in the MED program concentrating on coaching. This is my 13th, going to be my 14th uh, season and year at the University of Mount Union. Prior to that, I was the head basketball coach at a small high school called Rootstown, and then um, was fortunate enough to be the head coach at uh, Jackson High School for six years. We currently teach a seven week course, the psychology of coaching, and it is exactly that, right? So seven weeks, we'll find different topics to choose from. Right now, it's, it's, it's in a unique situation for all levels and how you're going to deal with um, administration, how you're going to deal with raising money, how we're going to deal with certain types of players who come from different backgrounds. Being able to handle social media and all the pressures that come with um, the anxiety and, and some of the mental the mental aspects of now what student athletes have to go through and, and even coaches have to deal with is a trend that you know we need to reflect on, talk about, and understand better as coaches. I think in our class right now there's such great feedback and dialogue and how how different people deal with that and there's not always one particular way to do it. So I think this class and, and this this concentration in coaching um, just gives a variety of different voices. You know, we were able to have Larry Karras speak on, you know, different methods and, and different ways, not only of communication, but motivating certain players and some of his experiences. Continuing to do that throughout the program is going to benefit every one of us. Hopefully we'll always be a resource, you know, for our students. Because there's going to be things that come up, especially for, you know, first time coaches, you know, a parent problem, you know, coach, how would you handle this? And just to be able to talk through that, you know, just when the class ends in seven weeks, doesn't mean that relationship doesn't end. I look forward to watching them to grow and, and, and teach me, you know, as the years go on. You know, coaching is, a, is just constantly learning, um, understanding the different trends that are happening, but ultimately it'll always come down to relationships and how, how you treat players and different ways to motivate them and communicate with them. The MED program allows coaches to be very flexible in their time. We understand the value of and, and what it takes to be a, a, a head coach, assistant coach during the season, but your ability to be able to do this at home, you know, at work when you have some free time is, is something that will benefit you as well.